Good morning, guys, and happy Sunday. So I'm off today. Um, I gotta turn my TV down because I know it's about to start talking. Okay, so I am off today. Um, Tyler gets up at like 3, 30, 4 o'clock. He has to be at work by 5. Um, he did get up a little later today because he got up at like 4 or something, but he got to work on time. Because um, I keep his lunches and everything packed, so really all he had to do was get dressed, brush his teeth, blah, blah, blah. Well, I'm actually tired. I didn't go to bed until after midnight. But, like, when he got up to leave like 4 o'clock, I stayed awake. I didn't fall back asleep. So, <laughs> Um, I definitely could probably right now fall back asleep, but I've been cleaning my bedroom. Um, we had some bags packed when we were going to go to my parents' house for the hurricane, so I just unpacked those. I've been picking up all of our dirty clothes and stuff and our water bottles, things like that. Um, extra things on the floor. My goal today is to get our bedroom clean so and clean our bedding. Um, go ahead and wash our bedding and clean our bathroom. Um, I've already picked up the bathroom. I just need to sweep and mop the floors and, like, you know, clean the mirror, the toilet, things like that. And, uh, I need to vacuum our floor in our bedroom. We have this basket that is, like, filled with socks. I'm not doing that. I, that's one thing I will not do, and it is socks. I will not do socks. I'd rather throw them all away and buy new packs. And we will probably do that one day. <laughs> so, right now it is 5.30 in the morning. Um... So, yeah, I have, like, this bookshelf in my bedroom, and it's, like, it's just crammed and stuff. Like, I have a purse on it. Tyler has stuff on it. It just looks so, like, crammy, like, crammed pack full of shit, but crammed pack full of stuff. And, um, but I have, like, all my nursing, I have nursing books and cookbooks and things like that on there. So, it's, like, I don't want to mess with it. And we have DVDs at the top, but even though we don't even watch DVDs anymore... But yeah, so that's the only thing that makes my bedroom look so freaking weird. And it's that freaking bookshelf. And it bothers me, but it's like I can't. And then the basket of socks are underneath it. It just looks crammy right there. But other than that, it's not bad. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to go ahead. I was kind of hungry. I'm like kind of confused because I've gained two pounds. And I have no freaking idea how. Because I haven't even been eating my points the last couple of days. So, I'm not sure if maybe I'm not getting enough sleep so my body's not breaking down everything. Um, or maybe, I mean, I know all bodies work differently. So, I'm just like, I don't know. I have been drinking more liquids lately. So, I don't know if it's from that. But I just find it very weird. But, anyway, so, man, I am getting a little tired. I'm probably going to end up taking a nap. So, I'm going to go, and but I'm, before I take a nap, I'm going to, like, sweep up our floors in our bathroom. Um, I'm not going to vacuum right now because, obviously, I live in an apartment complex, and I'm not sure if people can hear through the walls. So, I don't, that's rude if I vacuum at 530 in the morning on a Sunday. So, I'm going to wait until it's light outside to vacuum. Um, Y'all want to see something cool that I really want to get opened, and I ordered it, like, months ago. Can y'all see that? Oh, shoot. It's an, it's a fake arm. Isn't that cool? It's a fake arm that, um, it's a little over a hundred bucks, but you can do, and it's legitly like a fake arm. Like, you know what? I'm just going to show you. I just saw it on my floor and I was like, that's, it's like you practice, um, IVs and, um, I'm not going to take it out of the plastic, but look at that. It's like, it's like squishy. I, I want to set it up. That was a goal I wanted to do this weekend, but you need red food coloring. I, honestly, I could do it with water, but I think beneficially I should do it with the red food coloring. So I have to set that all up to be able to IV and stuff. I got that months ago, but I just don't have time to do it. I mean, I tell myself I don't have time for things. Do y'all do that? Like, I don't have time for that. In all reality, I probably got time for that because I got time to watch YouTube. <laughs> But anyway, okay, so I just want to tell y'all good morning, and we'll see where this day takes us. I don't want to eat breakfast right now because it's 5.30 in the morning, so I'm just going to keep drinking my sugar-free strawberry lemonade thing, and see, that's the bookshelf. You see how crammed that looks? It's like I probably could get rid of some stuff, but I haven't. Um, but yeah, so let's get on with this day. Let's see, let's see what I do today. Alrighty, guys, so it is 7.20 now. And I am hungry, and um, I'm gonna I'm gonna eat breakfast. I don't know what I'm gonna eat. 
I've done a load of laundry. I've cleaned my kitchen. I mean, no, I've cleaned my bathroom. My kitchen's already clean. I've cleaned my bathroom. I've cleaned my bedroom. I've done laundry. Um, actually, I've done like pretty much like two loads of laundry because I had to unpack our bags. Yeah, I don't even know what else I've done, but it's been a long couple hours. So um, I'm gonna make me something to eat and then I'm actually not gonna do anything else. I'm just gonna chill. And then I'm going to leave around like 9 o'clock. Um, no, not 9 o'clock. Probably like 9.30. Go to Aldi and get um, some type of sandwich thing Tyler likes that he ate all the rest of. So I wanted to get him some so he could have some in the fridge if he decides to eat him for breakfast this morning. The next couple mornings. And then I'm going to head to Office Depot and I bought the wrong boxes to ship off my stuff so i have to repack everything right, we're gonna see how this works because i put um almost one cup of these country style hash browns into this you can see them out of the side because the last time i did a half cup um i couldn't get them crispy on both sides so i did them like this so i could push it down so it would touch both sides so it could get crispy so we'll see how this works it's squirting some out the sides now milk with a pack of organic stevia Two fried eggs being cooked up. Yummy. Alrighty, guys. So, I finished up my eggs in here, and I took my hash brown and put it in here, too. You see, it got that circular shape from the, um, the griddle, but I wanted to get it more crispy. So, I'm just toasting it up in here to make it look crispy. Alrighty, guys. So, this is my two-point breakfast. Um, this isn't a full cup of hash browns, but I'm just counting it as a full cup. So we got a full cup of hash browns, two fried eggs, and some grapes. On top of the hash browns, I have like just like a drop of ketchup and a couple drops of sugar-free syrup. So they don't count as anything. The ketchup is sugar-free, g Hughes sugar-free ketchup. So yeah, that's what I put on top. Is it weird that I put syrup on top of my hash browns? Whenever I like go to Waffle House and stuff, I love syrup mixed with the eggs and hash browns. So yeah. Alrighty, guys. So we are fixing to, or I, I... And fixing to head to um, Aldi and then Office Depot. Maybe St Aldi, Starbucks, Office Depot, probably in that order. Maybe not Starbucks, but right now I kind of want one, even though I was just drinking a coffee. But I just wanted to keep you updated what's going on on my Sunday. It is 9, around 9.20. So, yep. Alrighty, guys. I am back from Aldi and Office Depot. I got a mini grocery thing from Aldi, so I'm going to go ahead and show you. I got some more unsweetened almond milk because I'm fixing to run out, so I don't want to make a big grocery haul. So since I was going to get some things for Tyler, like those, I decided to go ahead and pick me another one up because it doesn't go bad until the end of October. I picked me up another one of my stock cold brew coffees because also I'm almost finished with that. I got these for Tyler. I bought these like um, like two months ago, and there were some left in the freezer. They're five points for a piece, but they're like small. But he likes them for breakfast, so that's the main reason I went to Aldi. Um, I found some uncured turkey franks. They are three points for a turkey link, so that's not bad. I picked up some more turkey breast. We got some turkey bacon. Theirs is one point a piece. I got some mint chocolate chip light ice cream. I have not had mint chocolate chip ice cream in a long time. This is three points for two thirds cup, which is not bad. I got some butter because Tyler uses a real butter. Um, I got these vanilla minis. I've never tried these, but I know a lot of people talk about them and they are three points a piece, so why not? And then I got this Southwestern style chicken canoa bowl and it is seven points. So that's my mini haul. That's what I got. So yeah, I just wanted to show you. Alrighty guys, it is 12 o'clock. I am hungry. So um, I'm gonna show you what I'm making for lunch. Um, let me so turn the I'm taking out. five of these, which is five points, the chicken, any Tyson's Tyson fries. We're gonna take one of these extreme wellness high fiber wraps for one point, a little bit of lettuce and mustard. And we're gonna make me a six point wrap. And then I'm gonna eat it with some applesauce and probably some grapes. And then I'm gonna show you what I'm throwing in the crock pot. All right, guys. So I just threw in three chicken tenders, which makes about two breasts. I poured in some jalapeno juice, a whole ranch packet, and some jalapeno peppers or jalapeno jalapenos. And then we're gonna. It's gonna be like a jalapeno chicken. So I'm gonna put it, the slow cooker on low, and then I'm gonna eat mine over cauliflower rice, and I'll put Tyler's over regular rice or potatoes or whatever. Good morning, guys. Why am I always touching my hair? I don't know. 
Good morning, guys, and happy Monday. What an exciting day it is. We love the start of a good week. Um, I'm right now um, fixing to make me an omelet. I was watching this Tasty on YouTube, and they were making omelets, and I want an omelet. So um, that's what we're about to do. So I'm heating up a pan. I got my two eggs whisked with some water and pepper. We got some Velveeta cheese, and I have a little bit of bell pepper cut up, and I'm going to make me an omelet. I have cla a new class. Um, I'm in, I start pediatrics today. So it starts at 9 a.m. and it goes until 11.50. So that is what we're about to do. Um, that's what I'm about to do. And right now it's like 8.20 probably. Um, but yeah, so I just wanted to let you know. And then I'm going to try the new trend of, of that girl on, that nurse on um, TikTok. Where she takes the bell pepper, she put cream cheese and everything with bagel seasoning because I don't, I'm not using this whole bell pepper and it's going to go bad because I already see it's turning a little wrinkly. So I cut it into little pieces and I'm going to make some um, cream cheese with everything but the bagel seasoning and I'm going to eat that with my lunch. So I just want to let you know. actually got it into omelet form. That is very surprising. But here we go. We got bell peppers, a slice of Velveeta cheese. This is going to be a one point omelet. Sounds so good. To me. Omelet looks like. Look how good that is. It is just a one point omelet. All right, guys. So we're doing a date night. We picked. So it's a no count night. I've counted all day today, and I've done well. Um, but we're not going to count dinner. It's going to be a fun dinner. So burgers and tacos. I yeah. cooked, but he cooked, but we decided to do, not eat that. Well, he'll probably eat some of it, and I'll. I can eat some tomorrow. It's it has cauliflower rice and stuff in it. But we decided to play, we're gonna play Scrabble. We're very boring 20 year olds. Um. Tell me about it. <laughs> if you have any options on what the hell to do on a night, let us know. We figured out that there's nothing to do except yep. for watching TV, and that gets boring. I'm 22, and he's tr turning 24 next month, and we are boring people. We don't, we don't, we like will occasionally drink, but it's like every month, like maybe one time, maybe not every month, maybe every couple months we'll drink like a drink or something. We, we're not partiers. We don't go and dance. There's not things like that that we do. So we don't like going to a bar. We don't like, like doing that. We don't do, I've never even been to a bar or a club. So I wouldn't even freaking know. But, but yeah, so let us know if you have any ideas. If you're going the wrong way. We're going to Jack and the Caja. Alrighty guys, so Tyler is making me a salad. I had two spicy chicken strips left over from Jack in the Box. So they don't have the spicy chicken strips on the app, but they have the um, crispy regular chicken strips. So I'm just counting them as the same. So two of them is seven points. So this is technically a seven point salad. When I use um, what dressing I use, I'll probably make like my Greek ranch and that'll be zero points. So yep, he's making me a salad. Yummy, look how good that is. The ranch dip. So I put a little bit of ranch in there. He's putting in a little bit of non-fat Greek yogurt. We're gonna mix it up a little bit and add in some water so it's not thick. So I can just pour it over my salad and that'll be a great dressing if you like ranch and you don't wanna spend the extra points, especially when you're having a seven point salad. Alrighty guys, so I am back from work. Um, Tyler made dinner last night and we didn't eat it. So that's what I'm about to eat tonight. So I'm gonna show you what it's gonna be. Alright guys, thank you for watching all these different clips from a couple different days. I really appreciate it. I've been busy with my new class starting, so that's exciting. Um, so thank you for getting this far. Go ahead and click that subscribe button if you enjoyed the video. Give me a thumbs up and we'll see you again later.